Welcome back, everybody, to L.A. Noir. This is part 15. We are going to Baron's Bar, and I recently just fucked up the whole question and answer thing with the husband. So, we will see what we can find from the bar. Gents? Drink? No, sir. Phelps and Galloway, LAPD. I'm Benny Clough. This is about Teresa Terrelson? Yes, it is. I heard about it on the radio. They're saying it was that Black Dahlia freak again? God damn it. Yeah, I rang that husband of hers. The babysitter said he was out. If you don't mind, we have a few questions. Last contact with the victim. What time did Teresa leave? Uh, around uh, 10.30, I think. Hmm. On foot, in a car, by bus? How was it? She called for a cab. Did you get the number? Sure I did. I like Teresa. The only time she has a drink is when things aren't going so good at home. I was worried about her. Put out an APB on the cab. 3591. Should be traceable. Okay. That's one heck of a Sunday. So, for some reason, I don't know why, but Cole's been extremely Who was she rude with? to this We've had reports about a tall, gaunt-looking hobo. He wasn't here last night? I get plenty of bums in here. But nothing to fit that description. Hmm. The likelihood is that whoever she left here with killed her. Give it up, Benny. All right, two creeps were all over her. Promising to take her dancing. You get a good look at these guys? Sure. I got a good look. One of them was a sailor in uniform. His cap Ooh. said, uh, USS Indiana. And the other man? The other guy is Richard Bates. He's sitting in the back right now. Red polo shirt. Thank you. Thank you for your help, Mr. Bluff. We'll take it from here. Ah. Hey, no problem. <sighs> got both of them correct. This is Bates. That's him. LAPD, don't make me chase you, shitbird. Hope. Oh. Can't let the son of a bitch get away. Hurdle, hurdle, hurdle. Hurdled. I'm getting after him. I thought you were going to leave me there. Who knows what this guy will pull when he's cornered. We could have a killer on our hands. God damn it. These cars suck to drive. Come on, Phelps. You're letting this lust get away from you. I don't want this car. I want a different car. This car sucks. I don't even know where you went. I don't really care about city damage because I know I'm going to fail this anyways. I don't think the killer would be kicking back in the bar where he had to pick it. Listen, a creature of habit is your killer. For some reason, they're sticking with your routine. Oh, son of a... <laughs> don't go to sleep on me. Be <laughs> fucking close. <laughs> He's showing you how it's done. Keep it steady and I'll try to bust his tires. Shoot straight. Let's end this part. Enough. Put your hands in the air! Man, that was a okay, baby. so much damage. You're gonna answer some questions. I have a choice in this. No, you really don't have a choice. Last night, you went drinking with a lady in the bar. Now she's dead. And your face is all messed up. I'm in the clear on that. She preferred a sailor. You could lay it off on him. Are we finished? Do you want my partner to sap you? Tell us what we want to know. She was okay. Drunk. Pissed off at her old man, wanting to go dancing. I thought I'd ply her with a few drinks and get my end away. Looks like your salty had the same idea. So what happened when you left the bar? 
Sailor Boy laid one on me, a cheap shot. After that, I don't know. He might actually. What happened to the woman? Your guess is as good as mine. We're taking you in, Bates. How Damn. come? Just for a chat. Nice private chat. I'll explain my theory of once a degenerate, always a degenerate. Take him to Central. He's a material witness in a murder case. Find him a cozy cell. Richard here knows the drill. up the questioning on that one again and I did so bad on the driving it was retarded <laughs> and I'm going to see if I can <laughs> use the phone for something what I don't know um, it's actually in here oh, it's right there I don't know why I would need to Operator, give me dispatch. Putting you through now. Are you drunk, Felt, Mister? That's twelve forty-seven. How can I help, Detective? I need an APB out on a yellow cab, number thirty-five ninety-one. Ask dispatch to relay all sightings to car eleven K. No problem. I'll get on the radio. Are there any incident reports filed in the vicinity of Barron's Bar on North Beaudry Avenue? We're tracking a sailor who was involved in a fight outside the bar. I can check the reports, Detective. I have a message for you from Captain Donnelly. Message reads, James Jessup, U.S. Navy Able Seaman, has information relevant to your case. Oh, okay. Jessup is currently being detained at Central Station. Could be our man. Thanks for your help. You know the way. You can drive. So we, something else to do there. I just don't know what. I think I need to talk to the husband again. Sailor on furlough, who looks like he's in trouble and knows it. All right, cool. 1947, not 1927. Two. It's over this way, but where? I don't know where. I'm going the wrong way. Skeleton goes into a bar and orders a beer and a mop. Ah, here we go. Detectives Phelps and Galloway. We know why you're here, Jessup. So it would be best if you answered our questions truthfully. I don't want any trouble. That's why I'm here. I heard on the radio about this lady getting killed. I got leave from my CO to come down straight away. So why did you kill her? I didn't kill anyone. Look, you need to believe me. Let's start at the beginning. You went to Baron's Bar. What time did you arrive? I got a 24-hour pass. I got there around 7. That's where you met Teresa Terrelson? Sure. We had a couple of drinks. So you tried to make a woman who was incredibly drunk? Look, I'm not proud of myself, but I never hurt her. You took her dancing? That's right. Caught a cab to the Crystal Ballroom. Okay. You had a fist fight with Richard Bates over Mrs. Terrelson. You met the guy? He's a creep. You should take a look at him for this. Oh, so you were defending Mrs. Terrelson's honor. He lied. Damn it. Yeah, something like that. If your story doesn't check out, Jessup, we're hanging you out to dry. Can you put the guy in two in a cell and inform the commander? Sure, detective. Why? Got a message for you. 
sighting of your disfigured hobo on Bran between Temple and Sunset. And it looks like the bow has a record, too. He's wanted in connection with two female assaults. Thanks. Uh-oh. Now these horse tricks off me at the grand jury. Case is thrown out. Thank you. Um, I don't know where to go first. You can drive. Where exactly are we going? Three suspects in the can and one on the hook. Still no hard evidence on any of them. Car 11K, 11K, come in. 11K, go ahead. Patrolman reporting that Bobby Ross's car game is breaking up at midnight. 11K, roger that. Only have time to get downtown, though. It's possible. Have them bring him in. So. KTPL, we have Lars Carrollson picked up. 11K, roger. So he said it was 8.30 that it ended, but they're saying the game ended at... 12 midnight, so Lars might actually be our guy. Because I got every single fucking question. I got a shotgun. Save it for someone who's interested. They're fascists. Come to move us on and steal what little we have left. Six rounds won't get us far. We need you to stay for the seven. We need to hold out. How do we do that? Like this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> down, you want your right to share? <laughs> we need to fight for it. These men know they're harboring a murderer. Bam. Utopia, bud. What's your name? Comrade Stalin. Very <laughs> funny. We'll find out from your personal effects. Stuart Ackerman. You're under suspicion for murder, Ackerman. We're taking you downtown. You. You can't do anything more to me than what the Japanese have already done. Kremlin's over here, Phelps. Toss it, see what you find. Yeah, there's the rope. Looks familiar. Safe bet it'll match the mark under Teresa Terrellson's chin. Can you go to this one? I want to see if there's anything here I can do. The husband has an alibi, but no real motive other than neglect. Jessup's alibi checks out. Bates is a recidivist. He'll be pulling the same stick until we put him away for good. Ackerman has... History, opportunity, hard evidence. What motive? We have the evidence. We know she was here. 
All we need is a confession. We can charge the bum with murder. <laughs> Every single time somebody hits somebody. <laughs> the driver AI is so bad. I thought they were gonna take him downtown. I know there's gotta be something I'm missing here. Why can't I investigate this further? Can I talk to him again? I can't believe Teresa's dead. appear to be connected. Move, Rusty. Thank you. Oh my god. Fucking boots. You can see if Pinker can match the impression of the crime scene. I think that's what I needed. Let's see if we can talk to him again. Please, can I have some time to explain to my daughters? Okay. Why can't he drive? Where's that cab got to now? Call 11K, your suspect vehicle, yellow cab, 3591, sighted at 6th and Valencia. Okay. You see our taxi anywhere? The search continues. I don't even know where 6th and Valencia is. Call 11K, yellow cab, 3591, was just seen leaving Dewey's car sales, driving north on Union Drive, KGBL. <laughs> Okay. Central Police Station. Dude, this thing is. This place is huge. Man. Hidden vehicle? Uh, hidden vehicle, okay. Watch it, will you? I remember saying it. Loma and Union Drive. So we need to find Loma. You guys see Loma? I don't see Loma. It's not giving me the other streets, so there's Union. That's Union Ave. Sixth Street Boulevard. Oh my gosh! Holy shoot! Okay, so this is me. 
I need to find Loma and Union. I see. I saw Union. Heading northeast. Jeez. I'm not finding it anywhere. Screw it, I'm just gonna drive around until like Three, five, nine, one at Roma and Union Drive, headed northeast. Like there's Move. to find Loma Drive and I will be okay. I won't be upset anymore. Because I'm not seeing it whatsoever. Main Broadway Hill, 5th, 6th Street, Street, Loma, Los Angeles. I don't see Loma. Union Ave, Temple, Union Beverly Boulevard. I don't even know where the Turkey Diner is. Still not seeing it whatsoever. Santa Monica Boulevard. Fine. Really? Really? Seriously? I can't even find it. I can't find Loma. I'm gonna have to wait till like something else comes up. Why won't that little bastard stay still? Find third street. Third street, right here. See? Right there. Head east, sunrise, north, south, east, so third street. Unless if there's like another third street. Will this like tell me where Loma is? No. It doesn't. So we have third street, but the problem with that is there's so many third streets. Like I bet you nah. 
We probably won't find another third street. Okay, so we have third street here. And where am I at? I was somewhere. Where did I go? Where, where did I go? Where is my symbol? I'm right here. Okay. So I need to turn around and go back over here. So I just need to turn around, really. There he goes again. One. That's him there, Phelps. Hit the siren. LAPD, we're investigating a murder. What's that got to do with me? The fair you picked up from Baron's bar last night. What was the woman wearing? It was a green dress. Oh, don't tell me something's happened to her. Tell me about her. She was with this sailor, and he was all over her. She wasn't having any of it. Said she just wanted to dance. But he had that look in his eye. Where did you drop them off? Is that the Crystal Ballroom. What time? Uh, after midnight. 12.30? Something like that. Thanks. You've been a big help. Well, that's going to ruin my day. Huh? Okay. I want you to drive. I don't want to drive. You drive. I need to go oh, over the case We have to go now. back there again? I don't even know. And where wanna... exactly are we going? <sighs> Carlson residence. What is there? Ugh. I'm just going to end it here. And because it's about that 30 minute mark also. So I will catch you guys in part 16. Peace.